Good morning! We are on our way to Salem and we're gonna go do all the witch stuff. Um, and it's supposed to rain this afternoon when we're doing one of our tours, but hopefully it'll hold off until then and we just have to walk around in the rain in a little bit. But that's about it. So we will see you in Salem. We just came out of the Salem Witch Museum and we sat through a narration and visual thing about the witch trials and then we went on a guided tour about uh, the history of witchcraft and now we're eating snacks and in the gift shop I got myself a book that yes. the only child who gets a book instead of a t-shirt well I didn't like any of the t-shirts in there but we're gonna get a t-shirt later so we we don't know what we're doing next, but we're gonna figure something out. So we will see you at our next stop. This is just to showcase how far in front of everybody I walk, because apparently I walk quite fast and they don't know how to keep up with me. So in the witch <clears throat> trials memorial where, and if you see these stones that are sticking out, those are the victims um, in order of where, in chronological order of when they were executed. And so while we are waiting, over in the side, he is reading the paper. Every single word. What's he reading? Oh, he's reading the little descriptions about all the people, stones, but it's not really that necessary because we just heard about it. We are now in the second oldest graveyard in America. And we don't know if any of the witchcraft victims were buried here, but I guess we'll find out. We are at Brody's Seaport for lunch. Mom and I are splitting fish and chips. Rosie got a burger with fries, and then Dad got the fish tacos. So if y'all don't know, Rosie and I uh, love ranch. We eat ranch with everything, and we asked for some ranch. But this is not buttermilk ranch. This is like spicy ranch. It tastes weird. But we're still gonna eat it because we gotta have our ranch with our fries, right? I mind. I just go to the up probably. <laughs> okay, so this is our normal day when we go out. We go and see a few things, we walk around a little bit. We eat a snack. This is like we've already eaten a nice breakfast. We eat a snack. Usually, yep, yeah, usually around noonish. So we can have a late lunch and early dinner. Well, then for the next hour to an hour and a half, all we hear is where we're going to eat, what are we going to eat, what can we find something to eat, what are we going to eat. So then we have to spend all of our time, even while we're doing our tour and looking at those stuff, trying to find somewhere to eat that they can eat at. So if you don't have teenagers but you have little kids, this is what you can look for. <laughs> where are you going to eat? So that becomes the most important thing in their entire life. Right, Rosie? Mm-hmm. But this, this is Elizabeth Montgomery as Samantha Stevens. It's her statue <coughs> from uh, Bewitched. Mom is a huge fan. We are at the witch house now, which I think is the uh, last standing original house from uh, 1692. So we'll let you know what's inside. Are you excited about this house? It's nice. I'm just hot. It, yeah, she's wearing a rain jacket. Hey, I'm the only one prepared for every situation around here. And she's got her Crocs on in case it rains. We are out of the witch house now and we took a few pictures so I will put them in there so you, uh, y'all can see what uh, we looked at and things like that. We learned a lot about the living and stuff during that time period. So I think we're just gonna go get some macaroons now and then head on back to the campground, right? So we will see you when we eat the macaroons. I also forgot to mention that the witch house is the judge is Judge Corwin's house. So he was pretty rich and Dad says he is probably a loyalist, so...
Where are we raising? In an antique store again. How do we feel about that? I words can't even describe how I feel about an antique store or a goodwill. Yeah, we don't like them, but we're about to leave, so that's good. Okay. We have gotten our macaron macaroons or macarons. I don't know how to pronounce it. We have raspberry, lemon, lily of the valley, vanilla, chocolate, and lime. And Dad has got to eat his lime, so here he goes. Well, now I thought I'd get two. No. No. How is it? Mm -hmm. That's all you had to say? Well, yeah, the consistency reminds me of a blue pass. What do you think, Mom? Flavor's good, though. Really good. Y'all, it has started raining, and look who's wearing their rain jacket. I guess she's prepared after all. Yeah, always be prepared. There's like a hundred percent chance of rain at this time. <laughs> I would just like to document this sketchy elevator that we're in. They're trying to get to the parking I feel tent. like it's 99 degree, or 99 percent humidity in here, and it's gonna rain. I like this thing that's breaking, it's stuck between floors. <laughs> it's so hot. So we are gonna play some phase 10 tonight. And Mama's gonna win. And tomorrow we're gonna be on the road to Bar Harbor. And uh, that's about it. So we will see you tomorrow. There'll be no sore losers tonight. You'll be sleeping outside. Bye.